Minister Narendra Modi on Thursday declared the 36th National Games Open at Narendra Modi Stadium in Ahmedabad. During the event, the Prime Minister also inaugurated the world-class Swarnim Gujarat Sports University in Desar. Addressing the gathering, Prime Minister said that the exhilarating atmosphere at the inauguration of the National Games was beyond words and added that the feeling and energy of such a grand event are beyond words. He recited the key words of the National Games anthem, Judega India, Jeeteka India, to the rousing accompaniment of everyone present in the stadium and said that the confidence shining on the face of the athlete is a precursor of the coming golden age of Indian sports. PM also praised the capability of the people of Gujarat for organizing such a grand event at such a short notice. Recalling the Grand Ronde show that took place in Ahmedabad on Wednesday, the Prime Minister said that everyone is astonished and proud to see such a spectacle. Such careful use of technology like drone will take Gujarat, India to new heights, the Prime Minister added. Remarking on the official mascot for the National Games 2022 is Savage, the Asiatic Lion. The Prime Minister said that the mascot reflects the mood of India's youth, a passion for fearless entry into the sporting arena. This is also a symbol of rising India in a global scenario. Speaking about the uniqueness of the stadium, the Prime Minister said that while other complexes are limited to only a few sport facilities, Sadar Patel Sports Complex has facilities for many sports like football, hockey, basketball, kabaddi, boxing and lawn tennis. Highlighting the progress made in the field of sports, the Prime Minister said that eight years ago, players from India used to participate in less than a hundred international events. On the contrary, the number of international events the players from India participate is now gone up to 300. The Prime Minister pointed out that this success was possible earlier, but sports in India was marred by corruption and nepotism instead of the required professionalism. We cleaned that and raised confidence in the youth for their dreams, he said. Remarking on the new India that does not believe only in mere policy making but also moves forward in tandem with the youth of the nation, the Prime Minister pointed out efforts like Fit India and Kelo India that have become a mass movement. He further added that the sports budget of the country has increased by almost 70% in the last eight years. This has led to more and more resources being made available to the players which help in creating more and more opportunities for the players. The Prime Minister remarked that sports universities are being set up in the nation and advanced sports infrastructures are being erected in every nook and corner of the country. Sri Modi further added that efforts are also being made to make the lives of the retired players easier. Work is also being done in this direction so that the new generation can benefit from the experiences of the retiring players. National Games are being held in the state of Gujarat for the very first time. It will be organized from September 29th to October 12th, 2022. Nearly 15,000 sportspersons, coaches and officials from across the country will be participating in 36 sports disciplines, making it the biggest national games ever. The sporting events will be organized in six cities of Ahmedabad, Gandhinagar, Surat, Vadodara, Rajkot and Bhavnagar. News Desk, Comedy Global.